Hey guys, it's Yana here and I am back with another Lightroom edit tutorial for you guys. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to delete people in the background of your image. So as you can see right here, there are some people in the background and I'm pretty sure this guy right here is trying to make a silly face or is probably trying to photobomb the image. And I don't even know what this one is. It looks like a dog. I thought it was a dog, but I think it's like a light something for nighttime. I really love this image. And it was really hard to just kick people out of the picture, even though you don't want them there. It's kind of rude to ask, even because it's a public space. And I think they were smoking weed there at that time. So... Yeah, and oh, there are some buildings right here and that, that pole right there. So we don't want that in the file image. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to delete all that. Like, all that. <laughs> so without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so I'll just go ahead, fast forward and edit this photo real quick. Edit that I would normally edit this in. And after that, I will show you how to delete the people. So fast forward right about now. Okay, so here we go. Before, after. Okay, so I went ahead and edited this photo. Uh, as you can see, before, here's the before, after, before, after. Um, I like it. It's very nice. The greens are really popping out. Um, it's really sharp here. It's like the details of the grass. But, um, like, look at that, the details. I forgot to tell you, I was using my Canon 5D Mark II, um, one over one, one over 1600 second shutter speed and aperture is f-stop 1.8, my ISO was 160, and the lens that I was using was the 85mm 1.8 lens. So, for the purpose of this video, as promised, I'm going to show you how to delete these people right here. At the back and these distraction so what I do is I click on this tool spot removal tool so what I do is I just click and drag oh make sure the settings are size could vary depending on the field that you would like to delete uh, feather I like to feather it out to make it more natural maybe a little bit more so my feather is around 68 opacity is around I want to increase it to 86 let's try it around there and let's go ahead and do it. So what I do is I just color it. So as you can see right here, you kind of deleted the grass a little bit as well. So what you need to do is place it where it catches some of the grass a little bit. So if you put it up here, it's a little bit. The further away you go from the image, it's different looking. So as you can see, it's not really natural because it's all white here and it has the grass there. So what I do is I place it where it normally copies the image a little bit. So there we go. Next one is this one. So for this guy right here, there's another tool that I would like to show you guys. You could also use the adjustment brush tool. So click on that. Um, for this one, it's very easy because we're dealing with a white background here. So we could definitely use the adjustment brush tool. So click on that. Um, choose exposure press command O to see where you're gonna be coloring so go ahead press the adjustment brush tool um, just color the guy out um, shout out to Rachel K thanks Rachel she's also a youtuber she's a great youtuber she taught me she commented on my previous video and she taught me how to bring out this red thingy when you color something so <laughs> which has been very helpful. So what you do is you just press Command O and then this this red thingy will show up and you know where you're gonna be coloring in. So let's get rid of the red thingy. Press Command O and then what I wanna do is just increase this and what I wanna do is just increase the exposure. It's just as easy as that look. Gone. 
he is gone except for this part because we didn't really or increase the shadows and contrast done he's completely gone as you can see now like I said that was the easiest part because we're dealing with a white background here if it wasn't white it's probably gonna be a lot trickier you're probably not gonna be able to do it in Lightroom alone you probably need Photoshop for that but um, maybe but you can so I'll show you for this one right here it's not a white backdrop um, but the background of this thing still has some consistency in the texture so it's so easy to remove it as well what you can do is go back to your spot removal tool press letter Q and color it in perfect now it just looks like a regular rock next one are these pole right here same thing with what we did same thing to what we did with this guy right here we can just use the adjustment brush tool again go to exposure press command O to see the red thingy and you just brush away and just increase the exposure and just increase the exposure and now that's gone and this one look how easy that is this one's a little bit tricky because it's a little bit darker color so what I do is I just go ahead and brush it brushing brushing and to enhance that increase the highlight increase the shadow <laughs> increase the contrast gone and let's see the full image there you go so the two guys over here are gone the dog looking light thingy is gone and the pole and the building is gone so now you have a very perfect no distraction in the background image you have it you guys so as always thank you all for watching thumbs up if you like this video and don't forget to subscribe to this channel to have more videos like this in the future and I will link all my social media down below if you would like to see my work and follow me in all of them. And I'll see you all next time.